HubSpot tasks and queues are a great way to stay organized, keep all of your priorities in front of yourself, and make sure that you're not missing any crucial communications with prospects or customers. So if you're looking at your deal board here, you can actually toggle over to a list. And what we're going to do is I'm going to quickly set up a filter and say, you know, if anyone is in the deal stage of a meeting, these five different deals here, I'm going to make a task for these five deals simply by selecting all right here. And then I can just hit this create task button and I can create a, a to do task. I'm going to say this is a regular priority. I'm going to assign these to myself. If I want, I can add these to a queue like my daily tasks. And I'm going to make these due today. I'm not going to wait around for getting to these. And so after I set these up, it's going to make my new tasks. And then I can hit this go to my tasks. You can also get there by under sales, go to tasks. So now I'm looking at those five tasks I just created. And so to use a queue, instead of having to go to one task and then come back out and find the next one, what a queue does is it's just gonna line up those records for you. In this case, these deal records, and I can go one at a time right through them. So I'm gonna hit select all again. I'm gonna hit this start five tasks right over here on the right hand side. And as soon as I do, it's gonna take me to the first deal record here. If these were contacts or companies, you can do the same thing. And now I get this handy uh, cue bar right up at the top. So I can reschedule this task. I can skip it. I can jump around in my kind of queue here if I need to skip ahead to one or another. But after I complete this task, I simply hit this checkbox. And now this is going to change over and I can hit next. Without going back to my list or back to my tasks, I can just go right ahead to this next record, perform the next task, place my call, place my email. This is a super good way to keep all of your teams up and running at speed because um, it just kind of automates, you know, one more thing for you. You don't have to think about where did I get these from. But so set up weekly tasks for yourself. Set up weekly tasks for your team members. You can have daily tasks. You can have monthly tasks. But it's, it's a great way to really put the, the system to use for yourself.